Right, this is how I make my standard pike dead bait rig that I use for probably 90-95% of pike fishing. Uh, these are components, ESOC semi-barbed trebles, they're nice wide gape, very sharp, strong. I use them in six, eight or fours. Six is the most, is the commonest uh, size I use. Rig sleeves, helicopter rig sleeves, ESP. ESP size nine swivels. And the Super 70 socks wire, 28 pounds is my favourite. Right. Yes. First job is to put the, the end treble on, the one on the end of the wire. Twice through the eye with the wire. Pull tight, nice and gently tight, but not slowly so that you don't kink the wire. Nice heavy pair of forceps clamped onto the line, ones that grip the line, grip the wire really well. Now I like to spin rather than crimp or twist. Yes. Once through, pull it down tight and then spin it back down towards your finger seven or eight times. Cut it off fairly tight. That's the end treble. Nice and neat and strong, never let me down. 18 inches of wire off the spool. Then the next treble, about six inches up above the, above the, above the bottom treble. Out there, lay, lie the wire along the shank, through the eye, and then down around the bend, the inside of the bend of the hook. Twist back up the shank three times, three, four times maybe. Back through the eye. Pull tight, that's the, that's the middle treble fixed. Then I slide on a uh, helicopter rig sleeve. ESP size 9 swivel. Again, twice through the eye of the, the um, swivel, twice through the eye of the swivel. Gently pull tight, back on with the forceps, and again spin it down the line seven or eight times. Once, once to just ease it tight, and then Cut it off nice and neatly. Slide that up over the swivel, part halfway over the swivel. That protects everything, stops the tangles. And that's it, finished trace.